pressure is on. Down by four points in the fourth quarter with four minutes to go. Nate Robinson's dribbling the ball, kicks it to Emdo. Emdo dribbles, crossing, trying to get open. Gets double teamed, sees the lane, drops to the basket. Windmill, two hand slam. That should swing the momentum. It's time to play some defense. We're making plays on offense, but the defense has been lackluster. Nets him bound the ball. Joe Johnson gets it. He shoots the J and he makes it. Why are we sagging off in the fourth quarter with less than four minutes to go? Rose takes the ball up the court. I'm trying to get my hands on it. I got to hit him with that ring around the Rosie. Let him know I'm trying to get it. I set a quick pick. He kicks it to Boozer. I roll to the top of the key. I hit him with the rolling pump fake. Ah, drive to the basket. Shoot the J. I shoot it, but it rims out. How would I miss it with everything green? Moving without the ball. Rip Hamilton finds me for the easy alley oop. A nice quick possession right there. Every point counts right now. Cut the lead to four points. Less than three minutes to go in the game. Time to make some plays. Uh oh, late getting back on defense. The computer sees it and they pass it inside for the easy two points. That's all right. We're going to hit them with our own type of cheese. A little bit of cheeseburger. Transition three. Hitting the three point line wide open for three. It's good. Trims the lead down to three points. We are right back in this game. Two minutes left in the game. Nets got the inbounds. I'm sagging off. Sagging off for a reason. That's the matchup we like. Me on Gerald Wallace. Darren Williams has the ball. What is Wallace doing? He's rolling away from the play. He's taking me out the play. Darren Williams crosses into the lane for the easy layup. We got to respond on offense. Now we got to put some points up on the board. Rose pass me the ball. Rose pass me the ball. Give me the rock, Rose. Rose ain't passing. Rose is driving. Rose is laying it up, but he blew it. Jakeem Noah with a big rebound, cleaning up that garbage. I don't know what Derrick Rose was thinking. That was just a terrible and selfish offensive possession. We can't keep going tit for tat. We need a defensive stop. I got my man. Rose, get your man. Rip, get your man. Boozer, get your man. Noah, get your man. Play some defense. Whose man is that? Who is guarding Joe Johnson? Why is he so wide open? Down by five points with less than a minute 30 to go. I got the ball. Now I got to make a play. Ooh, instantly double team. Somebody's got to be open. I roll it to Noah. Bad pass to the post. He gives it back to me. I'm crossing. I'm getting double teamed again. I pass it to Rose. Rose drives. Whoops, he passes out of it. I get in the paint. I'm waiting for that rebound. Rose shoots the J. I know he's going to miss. Oh, he makes it. Rose finally steps up and makes a play. We officially have a one possession game. All we got to do is get a stop and hit a three, and the game is tied up. Nets inbound the ball. Joe Johnson gets it. Uh oh, Rip. Don't get embarrassed, Rip. Play him tight, Rip. Play him tight, Rip. No holding. What is he doing? Why is he stalling? He's draining the clock. The CPU is draining the clock. Now they're running plays. Darrell Williams gets the ball. He's wide open. He shoots the J. He misses it. I got boards. No, I don't. Chris Humphreys. Shout out to Kim K. Chris Humphreys with the putback. It's do or die time. We can't beat him with a two. We got to shoot a three. Give me the ball, Rip. Give me the ball, Rip. Give me the ball, Rip. Quick possession. I yanked the three. It's good. Contested three is made. Down by two. One possession game. We can win it with a three. We got to get a stop. Darren Williams bringing the ball up court. D. Rose with the defense. I'm guarding Jared Wallace. We got to make a play. Don't let nobody get open. Don't let nobody get open. If anybody, let Jared Wallace get open. D. Rose with a tight D. Ooh, he passes it off. Darren Williams calls for it again. He's crossing. He's doing the necessary dribble moves. He shoots. He misses. We got the board. We got the board. We got to put up a basket. Give me the ball, D. This is my legacy right here. Give me the ball, D. Ooh. Ooh, I'm double team. I bring it out. I bring it out for the three-pointer. Ah, won the game, baby. We win the game. That's how we seal the game off, man. That's how we do it. Hockey's the fastest sport out there. Crazy thing is, you never know what's going to happen. Oh! <laughs> Overtime, playoffs, game one. One shot wins the game. Let's go! Yeah, I'll tie him up and we'll just both rush. Let's go. First shot of the game, it's over. Okay, hey, are you ready? I'm tying, I'm tying. <gasps> Let's go! That was...
<laughs> that was exactly how I pictured it in my head. We're like, let's tie up, let's go straight up, first shot wins the game. What a snipe! <laughs> what is going on guys National go. 61 here and I hope you enjoyed that little intro just wanted to give you guys a little backdrop on what's going on in this gameplay so in NHL 13 there's a game mode called ESHL EA Sports Hockey League and in that game mode you control only one player on the ice and you can have a full team of up to six including a goalie which makes for some very interesting and very entertaining gameplay uh, but most importantly at the end of each month there's what we call ESHL playoffs and you're put into a division based on your regular season rankings. You're put into either amateur, pro, or elite. And right here, we're in elite. And last month, we actually finished elite champions, which was pretty impressive. In order to win the championship, you have to win four playoff games in a row. If you lose one, you're eliminated. So that's why uh, we go absolutely berserk after scoring that OT winner as you saw in the intro uh, that was from the first round this right here is actually game three and if I make it to round three of this sports commentator March Madness I'll definitely show you guys the championship because it is very interesting as well but enough about the gameplay I want to jump into a little topic here first of all I just want to thank you guys so much for all the support there were just so many great supportive comments, and I seriously can't thank you guys enough for that. I read through them all. I really appreciate them, and it really does mean a lot to me. And that kind of leads into a little short story I want to share with you guys. So yesterday, I was at the Columbus Blue Jackets game. Hockey here in Columbus. We're a pretty bad hockey team. We've been bad for the whole 13 years we've been here. Had one playoff appearance and didn't win a game, but we're starting to turn it around here with a little three-game win streak. Regardless... I met a fan of my videos for the first time in real life and that really opened my eyes just to realize like how awesome this YouTube thing is. Uh, he brought me a hat for him to autograph and it was just like an awesome experience. He tweeted me before the game, he said he would be there and I was just like if you see me just yell for me and he recognized me, yelled out for me, just yelled Nasher and started running up to me and I got to meet and talk to him for a bit and there's one thing like seeing comments on a video but actually meeting a fan in real life is just a whole new wave of emotions for me and it was just really cool and I really appreciate it. He's just a little freshman growing up and watching my videos but hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay commentary and i will see you guys later